So today I'm going to show you how to add a new route to um, our application. So what we want to do is when I say localhost um, greet, uh, I'm going to get a message back. Right? Um, so in order to do that, we need to add the path onto your router and then add a controller to handle that path and then add a view to uh, show the user um, what you want to display. Okay, so then if uh, open up your terminal, if you type in mix phoenix um, dot routes with an S, you should see, yeah, let's just type that again. Um, you should see the only path right now we currently handle is just the root path, right? So then now what we want to do is open up your project in your ed text editor and then uh, in web router. Open that up and scroll all the way down uh, to line 19. And then what we have here, we want to say we will accept a get request with the greet path. So, and then we're going to have a greet controller. Um, handle this, the greet controller hello function handle this request. And right now, of course, we're going to have an error because we don't have a greet controller. So let's create that. So in web controllers, create a new file called greet controller.ex. Okay. Um, and in this uh, project, we're going to say def module uh, blog, which is our project name. Um, and greet controller uh, do and and okay so what we need to do is we need to import in um, code in order to handle the request so first we're going to say use uh, blog which is the our project name you want to say web um, and say comma and then controller okay um, and then we're going to say def and type in hello. And we'll say welcome to accept. We need to, actually, we need to accept two uh, params. The first one is the connection. The second one is the params itself, uh, which is like user data information. Uh, because we don't need to, we're not accepting any user data right now. So I'm just going to put an underscore to indicate that that uh, it's not being used. So right here, we're going to say, when you come here, just show um, the hello index file, sorry, hello file. So that's what we would say, render, um, give it, you need to give it the connection, and then I want you to display the hello HTML file. So let's go back to this use web blog, uh, blog web for a second. So this is referring to web, web.ex right here. Uh, if you scroll down to line 29, notice here we have, so notice this uh, module is called blog web. And then down here, the definition is controller. So what we, when we say use, it's going to import um, or insert all of these code into our controller. So then that way we can use things like the word render. Right, so when we do render, what it's going to look for, it's going to look for, um, in the views, it's going to look for a new file. Well, not a new file, sorry. It's going to look for um, a module called greet view. So we're going to create a file called greet view.ex right here. Um, and then def module um, blog dot greet view. And what this file does is, is going to tell you where to look for that hello.html file. So in here, if you type in use uh, blog.web, comma, view. So remember that web ex file we had open earlier. So if you scroll down on line 42, this is where you define. Um, it's going to import all, of, insert all of this code into your view. And notice down here, this uh, Phoenix view, it defines where uh, your layouts information are going to be. So if you look in web the templates, um, this is where your 
pretty much HTML file are gonna be. So notice here you have that page, which will match to that page controller. So we need to create a new folder called greet. And in that greet folder, we need to create a new file called hello. Uh, hello dot um, HTML, HTML dot EEX. Okay. So this greet file will, um, I just wanted to display hello world, but you can display whatever you want. Hello world H1. Okay. So let's start our server. So mix phoenix dot server. Okay, so now it's being started on port 4000. So localhost 4000. Okay, it's up and running. And now we type in greet. And notice we have this hello word um, in front of us. So just an overview. Uh, when we type in hello uh, localhost 4000 greet, it's going to go into the router and it's going to find a controller that handles that path. And then here we're saying the greet controller will handle um, that path. And this is the function that handle it. So then it's going to go into the greet controller and it's saying, um, yes, uh, show the user this hello HTML file, which is in templates um, in the folder greet, which should match up with the controller um, hello.html. That's it.